do everything a retired person does. I'm retired. <laughs> Barcelona is one of the best kept secrets, and now everyone knows how good it is. I mean, obviously, word got now it's it's amazing, and it definitely is. He's just you know grown so much as a person. I mean, he's just come so far in such a short time. It's really amazing. I'm really proud of him. When I'm not skateboarding or shooting photos, I'm grilling. I'm cooking food to make some nice Mediterranean chicken kebabs. He's always just joking around. He's never serious. Like, he definitely doesn't care who's watching. He's just having a good time when he skates. There are some treasures that should be left buried. Some artifacts better left undisturbed. And some you've been waiting years to open. At last, the complete adventures of Indiana Jones arrives on DVD. Dr. Jones Jr. Indiana Jones. Right. From legendary filmmakers George Lucas and Steven Spielberg. <laughs> And starring Harrison Ford comes this extraordinary four-disc collection, which includes all three films, Indiana Jones and the Raiders of the Lost Ark, Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom, Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. Now, you can experience each of these epic adventures like you've never seen them before. Digitally restored frame by frame and remastered for the ultimate picture quality. And for the first time ever, remixed in 5.1 surround to give you unsurpassed sound. You call this archaeology? <laughs> To bring you even more adventure, Lucasfilm has delved deep into their archives to produce an amazing fourth disc loaded with never-before-seen features that you will treasure forever. Trust me. This October, bring home the ultimate hero in the ultimate adventures on the ultimate format in the ultimate collection. You have chosen wisely. The Adventures of Indiana Jones, the complete DVD movie collection. Own it October 21st. some of it. Well, well, I was at a family barbecue. <laughs> Since 9-11, we've gone high-tech over the water, so the dope runners have gone low. The biggest shipment on record is coming in tonight, and we want to know who's behind it. What could go wrong with that? With you alive. I can't be in a gunfight every day. We just want to talk. You want to talk? Oh, go. They can't hear you because they're still shooting at you. Yeah, 
right, man? Bullets, man. Oh, excuse me. You didn't tell Marcus about us. No. Mike, he's my brother, okay? Don't be scared. Whoa, hey, I ain't say I was scared. <laughs> Just <laughs> something wrong with your brother. <laughs> Mike, did you notice when we left, everybody was dead? No, no, the, we didn't kill the one dude. This has got to be the worst, most emotional cop week of my life. Yeah, it's been a little rough. The United States does not negotiate with hostage takers. This is not just a situation. It's my sister. I don't want to know what you guys are cooking up. We ride together. We die together. Bad boys for life. Yeah, almost as good as a man. <laughs> and a family that was something else. Mrs. Bamra, you must be very proud of your daughter. Not at all. And you three shouldn't encourage her. Girls aren't supposed to play soccer. My mom's never wanted me to play. You just can't take no for an answer. Whoops. Oh, will you both pack it in? I'm not going to give it up. All I'm saying is there is a reason why Sporty Spice is the only one of them without a boyfriend. I don't want you running around half naked in front of men. We've been invited to play in Germany this Saturday. It's going to be an American scout there. I can't. What are you going to have to give up next? It's about knowing what's right. She's got tremendous potential. I think we know better our daughter's potential. Following your heart. He likes you. I think so. Oh, you're quite pretty, you know. You do something with your hair and put a bit of makeup on. You look all right. And finding the strength. Why are they so frightened to let you play? This is taking me away from everything they know. Whose life you live in, Jess? To bend the rules. Fox Searchlight Pictures presents the international smash hit everyone's cheering for. Bend it like Beckham. This is where you spoil her to work. No, this is how it started with your niece, running off to become a model wearing small, small skirts. Mom, she's a fashion designer. She's divorced, that's what she is. and it ain't pretty. You found an illegal chinchilla ranch? You're good. Hey, sorry about breaking your stick. You know, when it's big like that, I just like to ride it rough and hard. <laughs> it's a nice ride. It's, oh, sorry. <laughs> Give me those coats. Ah! Oh, Jason! Surprise! You always fall for the bad guy. Then this guy must be really evil. You've never had trouble finding someone? I'm gonna teach you and your friends about Pan. Good evening, Charlie. Madison, is that you? Sorry, Charlie. I don't take orders from a speaker box anymore. I work for myself. Well, your boss sucks. This is it, you ready? Are you? You all fine, but you're crazy. Monday. I'll be a rescuer today. 
They have 50 armed men. I know, it hardly seems fair. We could really use Bosley's help on this one. I'll get to drive the race car. Heidi, O'Malley. Man, you ain't never heard of no black Irish. Black Irish. Who you think invented the Mac Rear? Lucky Charm, Sam Rock Shea. in my butt. I can't hardly walk. Seven trillion fish in the ocean. I have to find my son! They're looking for one. His son, Bingo, Nemo, Nemo was taken to uh, Sydney! Oh, sure. Ah! It's in that direction. Walt Disney Pictures presents a Pixar Animation Studios film. Sweet. Totally. I gotta find my son, Nemo! Go easy on him. He's lost his son, Fabio. <laughs> fish are friends, not food. <laughs> Grab shell, dude! Your ex is coming up, man! You mean the swirling vortex of terror? That's it, dude! Go, go, go! Oh, Rogers! Oh. Rogers! Finding Nemo. First you were all like, whoa! And then we were like, whoa! And then you were like, whoa. What are you talking about? You got serious thrill issues, dude. Bruce, you've had a terrible accident. You're wondering why you're still alive. You're thinking there's something different. You may not want to believe it, but I can see it in your eyes. Come by, we'll have some breakfast. It'll be a long trip. I'm in Venice. Learn the language of poetry, art, romance, sex. <laughs> Unlike you, my friend, I don't need a guidebook. The plan was flawless. The next 45 minutes, we own this place, gentlemen. OK, Steve, it's right above you. The heist was perfect. The escape was clean. <laughs> What are you gonna do with your share? I'm gonna get a Nancy 77 with the 70 watt amps and Burr Brown VACs. It's a big stereo. Speakers so loud they blow women's clothes off. The only threat was the one they never saw coming. What the hell are you doing? I made a few plans of my own. There's nowhere you can go or we won't find you. That's probably right, John. Now. Found him, Stella. He's in Los Angeles. Stealing that gold is not gonna bring my father back. It's not about the gold. John was like a father to me, too. And I just can't move on until I've set things right. They're not in it for the pay. Hey, Steve. The gang's all here. You have no idea how hard it is for me not to reach across this table and kill you. You want to start the game up again? That's fine with me. They're in it for the payback. Come on! You'll try to take out my guards. I have five of them that you don't know about. I don't do dogs. I had a real bad experience. What happened? I had a bad experience. You tried to hack the system. You ready to create the biggest traffic jam in the history of Los Angeles? I'm so ready. Oops. You gonna try to crack my safe? He took my father from me. I'm taking this. You just blew the best thing you had going for you. You just blew the element of surprise. Surprised? Why do you get to punch him and I don't? Paramount Pictures presents... The gold is coming to us. Gridlock every route except for the one we choose. Force that truck to go exactly where we want it to go. Stop them before they hit the street! This is it, guys. Moment of truth. We made our play, and I came out on top. It's over when I say it's over. Five seconds of paint on the train. Mark Wahlberg, Charlize Theron, Edward Norton, Seth Green, Jason Statham, Mose Daff, and Donald Sutherland. You're out of moves. The game is over. Just give up already. You've 
have no imagination. What happened to my truck? Yeah! Got the Holy Spirit. The Italian job. You know this is never about the gold. Whatever helps you sleep at night, sweetheart. Oh. idea all sops are cool. We don't know how he'll react and how Space Bug will react to his reactions. Someone is after this ancient artifact. What we don't know is why. That terrifies us. Pandora's box. Do you mean the Greek myth? That's the Sunday School version. It's a weapon more powerful than you could ever imagine. Her Majesty formally requests that you find and recover this box before it's too late. Oh. Well, now that I have Her Majesty's permission. So this rock is the map to Pandora's box. And just think you could take it now. Oh, Croft. Do you really think I would do that to you? of great peril, the world must call upon the services of a singular individual. Welcome to the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. I'm waiting to be impressed. The greatest adventurer who ever lived has been recruited to find a madman. To stop him, you must lead a team like nothing the world has seen. Cheers. Service. 
Extraordinary gentlemen indeed. And women. Our transportation has arrived. You have four days. And the game is on. So what are we dealing with? Unstoppable assassins. 20th Century Fox invites you... They're indestructible! ...to discover an adventure... Take your eyes from the ground! ...in a league of its own. Surface! Sean Connery... ...the League. That was naughty. In America, there are those who make the law and those who make it look good. Oh, excuse me. Elle Woods found the perfect job. We're lawyers. We have to fight for justice. Where she could speak up for the underdog. Animal testing for cosmetics is unjust. The cost of beauty is much too high. I can't believe I just said that. You're fired, Elle. What? Don't cry, you can do this. Okay, don't cry hard. <laughs> Now, she's taking her fight to the nation's capital. Washington, you fall asleep when we watch the West Wing. But have you seen what they're wearing? Too Nancy, too Hillary, too Monica. Too perfect for words. <laughs> Hello, Patriots. I don't think I've been this excited since Gucci became a publicly traded company. Oh my god, it's Capital Barbie. <laughs> She may not have the experience. I'm Al Woods. I'm actually an old congressman from Delaware. I've been to Delaware, no sales tax. Good win, sir. You're out of order, Ms. Woods. She doesn't have the support. Perhaps you could look at my economics incentive chart. It's pop-up. But that won't stop one woman. You know what I thought the first time I saw you? That woman wears a lot of pink. No. That woman can make a difference. From rising to the challenge. You can't get the people oh, yeah. to care. Watch me. I can't do this alone. I'm calling in reinforcements. And July 2nd. <laughs> celebrate the land of the free. Let's hit the hill. You look like the 4th of July. It makes me want to have a hot dog real bad. And the home of the blonde. You have to get a bill before you have a hearing. Like this one? But it's pink and scented. Reese Witherspoon. Never no, underestimate no, no. a woman with a French manicure and a Harvard law degree. Delta! No! Legally Blonde 2, Red, White, and Blonde.
my favorite part of it is the thrill of the hunt and never knowing what you're going to get a hold of until you get a hold of it. And once you catch that fish or whatever it might be, uh, there's a, a the, the, not the adrenaline, but the thrill of the hunt is there. It's just, noodlers aren't just fishermen, they're hunters. They hunt for a living. A lot of my friends that go with me are, are excellent noodlers. Uh, but uh, for some reason, I seem to have a knack for catching more than they do. And I think it's, I don't know what it is, but the fish, I don't know if they trust me or what, but I, I just seem to have a knack to catch more fish than most guys do. He does catch anything and everything. Uh, he does it without the aid of gloves or uh, rope under the water or anything else. And he will stick to a spot until he does catch the fish. But, but when you're in a river and you're down under logs and you have snakes and turtles and beavers and all the other stuff in the river to contend with, when you catch a fish in a river, You've, I mean, you almost lose all human instincts. Your human instincts are gone. You're not a, you're not a human anymore, you're an animal. Bend them like that, paralyzed fish there. I think I'll noodle till I die, if that's not what kills me. You don't know what this is, do you? Aztec gold. The heathen gods placed upon the gold a terrible curse. Ten years we've searched. Every last piece we have found, save for this. Hello, Bobby. They've taken Elizabeth. Welcome aboard the Black Pearl. We must save her. Where do we start? Jack Sparrow. He talked about the Black Pearl. Make a deal with him. He could lead us to it. You forget your place. You are a blacksmith. If you spring me from this cell, I shall take you to the Black Pearl and your bonnie lass. You're a pirate. I forgot one very important thing, mate. I'm Captain Jack Sparrow. Not sure I deserve it. You're not facing normal pirates. <laughs> Cruel, demented, vicious pirates, to be certain. Say goodbye! Goodbye. Past cruel, demented, vicious pirates who cannot be killed. The moonlight shows us for what we really are. That's interesting. We are cursed men. I hardly believe in ghost stories anymore. You best start believing in ghost stories, Miss Turner. You're in one. Chance you all remember Captain Jack Sparrow. Kill him. I'm gonna teach you the meaning of pain. You like pain? <laughs> Try wearing a corset. There have been many ideas of what Texas is, what it should become. We are not all in agreement. But I'd like to ask each of you what it is you value so highly that you are willing to fight 
and possibly die for. We will call that Texas. There are only a few hundred of us. They are nearly 4,000 strong. But if you wish to stay here, in the Alamo, we will show the world what patriots are made of. for what they believed, protected what they loved, and gave the world a legend to remember. The hour is at hand! The Alamo. Street, in this ordinary house, something has grown out of control. It has the strength of an army and an appetite that can never be satisfied. Now, there's only one man who can face it. <coughs> and it's not him. This Christmas, 12 kids? That's nuts. The more. The scarier. It's gonna hurt. Steve Martin. 12 kids later and we still got the heat. Things are getting pretty twisted around here. Great. Cheaper by the dozen. Thanks for ruining my life. <laughs> the two disc Dirty Dancing Ultimate Edition DVD. Experience dirty dancing as you've never experienced it before with a newly remastered widescreen picture. All new audio including 6.1 DTS ES and 5.1 Dolby EX digital surround audio. This DVD includes a commentary track with key choreographers, costume and production designers. Other features include interviews with Jennifer Grey, Eleanor Bergstein, Kenny Ortega and Miranda Garrison. This Ultimate Edition DVD also contains a director Emil Artelino featurette, Jennifer Gray's original screen test, and a unique trivia track. Includes an exclusive sneak peek of the upcoming Dirty Dancing Havana Nights, which comes to theaters in February 2004. Have the ultimate time of your life. The Dirty Dancing Ultimate Edition DVD. What does looking have to do with it? Just feel the music. Just feel the music.
Hi, Mrs. Kwan. Hi. Thanks for babysitting on such short notice. I'll be back in a couple of hours. Conrad, Sally, remember the rules. No playing ball in the house, no fighting, no answering the phone, city morgue. And absolutely no one sets foot in the living room or else. Hit me. This holiday season. What was that? Universal Pictures, DreamWorks Pictures, and Imagine Entertainment invite you to the ultimate house party. Let's get this party started. From Ryan Grazer, the producer of The Grinch. Mike Myers. This cat is currently in violation of 17 of your mother's rules. The Cat in the Hat. Homona, homona, homona. Who is this? <laughs> That's my mom. Awkward. New Line Cinema proudly presents a little holiday story. One Christmas Eve, Santa Claus got an unexpected gift of his own. What in the name of Sam Hill? 30 years later... Let's recite the code of the elves, shall we? The best way to spread Christmas cheer is singing loud for all to hear. Buddy's discovering who he really is. You're not like the rest of us. I was sure when you cracked six feet that it would come up. My bad. You're not an elf. No! Now, he's taking a journey to find the family he's never known in a place where he finally fits in. Boy. And nothing's going to stop him. Sorry, your car's pretty. Will Ferrell is elf. What's your name? Does someone need a hug? <laughs> ah! Ah! Nutcracker! Catch the holiday spirit this November. Just try to hug you! This is the ancestral mansion of the Gracie family. It's a real fixer-upper. With a Victorian ballroom, secret passageways, spacious grounds with room for the whole family, and a mystery that has cursed the house for over 100 years. But no one told the Evers family. Honey, you know they have uh, dead people in the backyard. Stay on the ground. Can I stay on the ground, please? Dark spirits from the grave come forth. Don't you make no dark spirits come out while I'm sitting there. Wait till I leave before the dark spirits come out. The Haunted Mansion. Please, sit. Relax. Consider this office your office. Now, sir. Tell me your troubles. Well. <laughs> yeah, come to Papa. Come on now. My wife has me between a rock and a hard place. That's her job. You should respect that. Sounds like to me. You gonna nail his. When a marriage hits the skids. Honey, my key doesn't work. <laughs> Can we talk? 
and there's a fortune to protect, Miles Massey is the best there is. So you propose that in spite of demonstrable infidelity on your part, your unoffending wife should be tossed out on her ear. Is that possible? It's a challenge. Your Honor, I call Heinz the Baron Kraus von Espy. Now, a man who is used to winning. Did she specify what kind of a husband she was looking for? She said she wanted a very rich husband. Is about to lose his heart to a woman. Look at her, an athlete at the peak of her powers. Excuse me. Who is ready to bite back. I would be delighted, honored, really, if you were. <laughs> Howard! <laughs> you named him after your ex. I'm sentimental. Friends, today, Miles Massey is here to tell you that love need cause us no fear. I assume you're a carnivore. Oh, Mr. Massey, you have no idea. Love need cause us no shame. Objection, Your Honor! Strangling the witness! I'm going to allow it. Love is good. Marilyn, what a pleasant... <clears throat> Who the hell are you? Howard and I are planning to marry. Dump him. I could have you just part for that. You fascinate me. Intolerable cruelty. going to be that easy, did you? You know, for a second there, yeah, I kind of did.
somewhere in the dark underworld, there is a plan. A plan to rule mankind. Now, the world's most elite organization must step forward to search the globe for evil, scour the continents for danger, and what they discover will turn the world upside down. <laughs> what am I wrong? Oh! Looney Tunes back in action. A rabbit, a duck, a girl, a boy. You. 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 Him. Her. Them. And the evil head of the Acme Corporation who's determined to take over the world. We must capture this son of a spy. And we must locate the diamond and use its powers for our own diabolical ends. <laughs> How do you like that, Mr. Slap Yourself on Your Own Face? <laughs> Who has dynamite? Welcome to my world. Loney Tunes back in action. Now that's funny. Exploding into theaters November 14th. Wood, Mr. Blakeney. Turn three times. May the Lord of Saints preserve us. Just a broken arms. You're in very good hands. Seven weeks sailing, and he happened on our exact position. Well, then perhaps he was looking for us. Damn, he was good. An act of war will cripple them. With basic repairs, we can get home as we are. We're not going home. The power of nature will threaten them. Our enemy has more than twice our guns, more than twice our numbers, and we are supposed to stop them. Torn between fulfilling his duty. The captain's not called Lucky Jack for no reason. Phantom or no, Lucky Jack, I love her. And the lives of the men he commands. Steady! He must face the invincible. He fights like you, Jack. A hunter becomes the hunted. Well then, there's not a moment to lose. Two feet six inches, sir. The men would follow you anywhere. But as a friend, I would say that we should have turned back weeks ago. It's leadership they want. Strength. Find that within yourself, and you will earn their respect. Take command of the ship. Take command of the ship. Thank you, sir. For home and for the prize! Hello! Stay off to us. Let's fly! Without anyone telling you what to do. Come with me, we'll never, never have to worry about grown up things again. Never is an awfully long time. The sun is 
is out. The flowers are all in bloom. He's back. Gentlemen, do not beg. Please, please. Why do you hate him so? Ready to lose the other one? Ah! Not this time. Ah! Ah! in the trenches have taught me this. Everybody has a secret they don't want you to find. Find something on every one of them. What do we got, people? Ricky Coleman, 36 years of age. Her husband's a Baptist minister. She had an abortion two years ago. And the guy holding her hand at the clinic? Not the best thing. Yes! <laughs> Trials are too important to be left up to juries. The defense has retained Rankin Fitch as their lead jury consultant. Ladies and gentlemen, let's find 11 more jurors just like her. Who's next? Nicholas Easter. Mr. Easter, that's the second time you've looked at your watch. Are we keeping you from something? I think if you knew my situation, you your might... Your situation? We accept this juror. Go ahead and take it. No objections, Your Honor. Enter Mr. Nicholas Easter as a juror. This whole thing is a disaster. They give you $16 a day. That's a price. Cash money, baby. Think about that for a second. $20 million ought to be enough to secure a jury. They're using video surveillance, wiretaps, finding out things about jurors their husbands and their wives don't even know. This is about you messing with my case, and the rules are law. That's what I was hired to do. Fell out. Hello, Rankin. I'd like to know who I'm speaking with. You can call me Marley. Hey, phone, 15 miles away. The fact is the jury's mine, and I can push it either way. For a price. How did he sound? Rich. This girl is an amateur. I want her photo and her real name by tonight. That's just gonna pie in this verdict. It's too close. We need more jurors. Everybody's got a button. We just gotta find out where and push. Nick Easter is spinning this jury. I know you're playing both sides. What's your price? Ten million. <laughs> Big number. I was under the impression we had already purchased a verdict. Do we have a deal or don't we? Make damn sure you don't underestimate me. Call for help. Somebody got to that girl. It's our job to protect them. Well, there's only so much I can do, all right? I can't protect you. I want you to find her. I want you to contain her. You're losing me, my jury! You have destroyed all those people's lives. Anyone can be gotten to. You have not The Fairley Brothers bring you a story of two brothers who are one of a kind. Well, I'm gonna have to level with you. Siamese twins ain't the easiest sell I've ever had. We're not Siamese. We're American. Stuck in the middle with you. Stuck in the middle with you. Ah! Stuck on you. Hey, what's a four-letter word for snatch? Grab. All right. Right. Oopsie. Here I am stuck in the middle with you. Oh, yes, I'm stuck in the middle with you. Mm -hmm. stuck in...
There is a line between real and hyper real. This year, ride that line right off the edge. Seems your buddy Junior turned up dead. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey that's my brother. Man. Feds think you did it. Agent McPherson, Federal Gang Task Force. Reapers think you did it. No, I can smash you right now. You and your little tricycle friends. Hell, everybody thinks you did it. <laughs> I want his head in Dojo's bowl by midnight. I took off so you wouldn't get dragged into it. So you left to protect me? What part of I don't love you anymore? Don't you understand? We got a plan, right? Wouldn't be any fun if it was easy. Does it have to be this much fun? Three dudes. A girl. You want some of this? Oh, I thought you'd never ask. A couple of bikes. Pick on girls. No, no. They had an eye for fashion, an ear for music, <laughs> and a way with words. Excellent. Tubular. Awesome. Radical. The 80s are back, and now you can collect all the best movies from the very best decade on DVD. Hot, very hot. <laughs> An explanation is probably long overdue. She's a sure thing, Kim. Shall we play a game? Get your mouth off her, Walker. You can do it. Remember, you're a melon. Jonathan, this is my mom. Well, what do you want me to do? Do it right. Oh, she loved it. Whoa. The 80s have never looked better. Trippendicular. Vile, bro. Totally bitchin'. Own a totally awesome collection of films today. on the SS Nancy. In all their adventures, the Rugrats the world. have always gone far. This is just like my bathy. Only there's no rebel ducky and I'm not Nikki. But this time... Whoa! It's a 40-foot wall of water! We're gonna need a bigger boat. They're going completely overboard. Abandoned Now, we're stuck on a tropical island that don't got no people on it. But we're here, Angelica. I mean people who matter. They're about to discover... <laughs> wild Adventure. Let's go. Well, there's the bald leading the bald. Wild Life. Crocodile! And something beyond their wildest dreams. <laughs> Monkey. Where'd you come from? This is supposed to be a deserted island. The wild thornberries. Look, it's Nigel's strawberry. I'm coming down. Are you okay, mister? Watch what I can do. <laughs> I'm a ballerina. Maybe he's got the IP rash. <laughs> Spike finds his voice. Could you give a dog a little warning? Oh, I'm so sorry. You know, it's funny. For a minute there, I thought I actually heard you talking to me. You talking to me? 
Are you talking to me? Yeah, I can talk to animals. It's a long story. Chucky <gasps> meets his double. You're gonna boo boo. Wah, wah, wah. When did Chucky start talking backwards? And Angelica. I love this song! Hey, me too! Meet her match. Woo! Should I stay or should I go? Woo! Yeah! Yeah, yeah, put a sock in it, knucklehead. Rugrats Go Wild. Featuring the voice of Bruce Willis as Spike. I ate one of Chucky's diapers one time, and let me tell you, that is spicy. Woof! That's right, I said woof! Walt Disney Pictures presents a motion picture as big as the holidays themselves. Ho, ho, ho! Santa Claus is back. Look out! But this year, Santa ran into a little problem. I've got to get married? He said yesterday, didn't he? <laughs> the sanitation process has begun. Yeah! Are you Santa Claus? Why would you ask me something like that? Because you have a reindeer. Yes, a lot of people have reindeer. Name five. <laughs> Experience all the wonder and magic of an unforgettable Disney event. We have Coco. We have a blanket. We have a horse-drawn sleigh. The only thing that's... It's snowing. It's like some kind of magic. <laughs> I'm Santa Claus. What? Uh-oh, we're in trouble. Tim Allen, the Santa Claus 2. Lady G. No, 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 no. That's gonna leave a mark. Coming to Disney DVD and video November 18th. Everybody loses a couple, and you either pack up and you go home or you keep fighting. <laughs> Critics are calling Seabiscuit the best film of the year. A beautiful tale of courage and triumph against all odds. Seabiscuit is magnificent, inspiring, and glorious. Newsweek says nothing can stop this story from putting a lump in your throat. He made me better. You made me better. Toby Maguire, Jeff Bridges, Chris Cooper. Seabiscuit. Rated PG-13. Coming to DVD December 16th. You have to understand, we thought Bobby was going to a school for the gifted. Bobby is gifted. You should see what he can do. Have you tried not being a mutant? Since the discovery of their existence, mutants have been regarded with fear, suspicion, often hatred. Drop the knives and put your hands in the air. I can't. Are they the next link in the evolutionary chain? Or simply a new species of humanity fighting for their share of the world? What do you need, William? Just your authorization for a special operation, Mr. President. We've managed to gather evidence of a mutant training facility in the Bump State, New York. This facility is a school. Sure it is. Nobody really knows how many even exist. Or how to find them. Except you. Who are you? I keep feeling something terrible is about to happen. I would never let anything happen to you. It's about to get very cold in here. I need you to read my mind. Sometimes the mind needs to discover things for itself. They say you're the bad guy. <gasps> is that what they said? You have that. Most people will never know anything beyond what they see. I have faith in you. The next time you feel like showing off, don't. I used to think you were one of a kind, Wolverine. I was wrong.
You shouldn't have come here. This is our war, not yours. 300,000 dead and counting. That's not a war, Mr. Ito. It's genocide. These people, they have no food. We can either help, or we can sit back and watch a country destroy itself on CNN. Rangers, Deltas, today we go. Name? Blackburn. Date of birth? 227-75. That was trained to fight. You trained to fight, Sergeant? I was trained to make a difference. So guess what? You're going out today. What? That's what you wanted, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Just remember when everybody else is shooting, shooting the same direction. You ever shot at anybody before? No, sorry. Me neither. Once that first bullet goes past your head, politics go right out the window. Hey, baby, it's me. You there? Pick up if you're there. I love you, baby. RPG! Hold on! Six farms gone down! My men are surrounded by thousands of Somali militia. I need help now. Where's the rescue squad? We're in. I can't do it. It's what you do right now that makes a difference. People ask me, why do you do it, man? They want to understand. It's about the men next to you. Don't let that man crawl. Somebody help that man. That's all it is. No one gets left behind. You know that. Nobody has to be a hero. It just sometimes turns out that way. going on out here? Nobody seems to know what to get Millie or Jimmy for their wedding present. I mean, you can find out where she's registered, maybe a place setting or maybe a silverware pattern. Okay, let's get to A movie that proves romance is a lot like baseball. Come on, fire one in here. This is ridiculous. I'm a professional. You're playing with my mind. I'm trying to play with your body. I knew it. You're trying to seduce me. Who are you? I'm the player to be named later. It's not whether you win or lose. It's how you play the game. Why are you shaking me off? I want to bring the heater to announce my presence with authority. Fastball. You having fun yet? Kevin Costner. Get hit, Crush. Shut up. Tim Robbins. I love winning. It's like better than losing. And Susan Sarandon. Honey, you are a regular nuclear meltdown. Star in the home run hit comedy. Can't you even let me enjoy the moment? The moment's over. Bull Durham. Own it today on special edition DVD at Best Buy from MGM Home Entertainment. that you've been decorated and they sent you here to be posted actually sir i'm here at my own request i've always wanted to see the frontier before it's gone a soldier in search of a dream there ain't nothing here lieutenant what about indians found a land and a people he never imagined and a love he never expected Dances with Wolves, the winner of seven Academy Awards, including Best Picture and Best Director, is now available for the first time on Special Edition DVD. Featuring the extended four-hour version, audio commentary from Kevin Costner, a new featurette series, new Dolby 5.1 stereo sound, and more. Discover this stirring motion picture event.
Dances with Wolves, the definitive special edition DVD. Glory. Gene Shalit calls it electrifying. Time's coming when we're going to have to ante up. Ante up and kick in like men. Like men! Breathtaking Ray's Joel Siegel. Color soldiers stop a bullet just as good as a white. And for less money, too. Awesome, says Time magazine. We ready, kind of. It's one of the great films of the decade. Glory, rated R. Someday when people look at me, they'll say, there goes Roy Hobbs, the best there ever was. TriStar Pictures presents Robert Redford in The Natural, the story of a father and a son. You got a gift, Roy, but it's not enough. Of love. He means the world to me. And desire. I'm not waiting for true love to come along, Roy. A champion. A Roy Hobbs comes along once, maybe twice in everybody's lifetime. And his destiny. With or without the records, they'll remember you. Best there is now, and best there ever will be. I wouldn't bet against me. I already have. Redford, Robert Duvall, Glenn Close, Kim Basinger, Wilford Brimley, Barbara Hershey, Robert Prosky, and Richard Farnsworth has read The Natural. Here, I dropped out of college, told him I wanted the infantry, combat, Vietnam. The first casualty of war is innocence. She's a human being, man! From Oliver Stone comes one of the most powerful films ever made, Platoon. Now on special edition DVD, winner of four Academy Awards, including Best Picture and Best Director. This definitive special edition DVD features 5.1 surround sound, audio commentary by Oliver Stone, the powerful Tour of the Inferno documentary, a new photo gallery, and more. Lock and load! This unforgettable masterpiece is now yours to own. Platoon. Ready, set, hot! After high school, I'm gonna play football at Notre Dame. Chasing a stupid dream causes nothing but you and everyone around you heartache. The problem with dreamers is they usually are not doers. Are you fully aware of the sacrifices you're going to have to make? It's the most beautiful campus in the world. Having dreams is what makes life tolerable. Notre Dame is for rich kids, smart kids. 
great athletes. It's not for us. Ever since I was a kid, I wanted to go to school here. And ever since I was a kid, everybody said it couldn't be done. I always listened to them, believe what they said. I don't want to do that anymore. Not supposed to be here. Not everyone is meant to go to college. I need your help. Why should I help? I just want to be a part of this university. You're nuts. Yeah, a lot of people have been telling me that lately. Sometimes a winner is a dreamer who just won't quit. <laughs> Hey, you guys! My son's going to Notre Dame! I'm here to play football for the Irish. I wish God would put your heart in some of my players' bodies. You're five feet nothing. A hundred and nothing. And you got hardly a speck of athletic ability. In this lifetime, you don't have to prove nothing to nobody except yourself. A true story from the creators of Hoosiers. You ready, champ? I've been ready for this my whole life.
Hi, I'm Tony Hawk, pro skater. I've been skating the last 22 years of my life, the last 18 as a professional. And the question I get asked most often is how do you learn to skate? What are the basics? So let's start skating. And uh, we're going to give you a general overview of what you need to get started in skating from the decks, trucks, wheels, bearings, and safety equipment. Okay, you've got the equipment. What can we do with it? Well, let's learn some basics of skateboarding. All right, let's talk about pushing. Pushing is the way you're going to get your momentum the first time you skate. The most important trick you're going to learn in skating is the ollie. Jumping up, using only your feet, and bringing the board up with you. The ollie is all about practice. Kickflips. Kickflips is one of the most frustrating tricks to learn in skateboarding. We're going to learn the basics of mini ramp skating. So you're comfortable with riding up the ramp and coming back down backwards. Next thing you want to learn is how to kick turn. The biggest step in skating a mini ramp is trying to figure out how to drop in on it. One slightly advanced move is called a rock to fakie, and uh, you can do it from a drop in because you have plenty of speed going up the next wall. And I will see you at the skate park. When you leave this building, you will be endowed with all my powers. <laughs> all the powers of God. This holiday season. I've got the power! <laughs> the guy next door. Oh, I've never seen the moon that big. We really shouldn't waste it. Gets a shot at being the man upstairs. Sam. Mm. Jim Carrey. <laughs> Bruce Almighty. Coming soon to DVD and video.